I'm Levi Sim, and right now I'd like to show you the Ruggerd Thunderhead 35 camera backpack. It is pretty dang good. It, um, I've, I've used a lot of backpacks, and early in my photography career, I owned a backpack similar to this, but it wasn't nearly as good as this, not nearly as well made as this. This bag is truly rugged, rugged. It's the brand name is Ruggerd this but it's a rugged bag and uh, let me let me show you what i mean it's got significantly large toothed zippers so that when you've got this thing jammed full of stuff you can really crank on them and it'll pull tightly closed and not not separate the zippers all the seams are taped that means that um that they're extra strong uh they they're all rolled over and then taped over with a binding ribbon so that they're not going to break that way uh the interior i like this quite a lot it's light colored, so you don't lose your lens caps in the, in the inside of a dark bag like you often do if the interior is black. It's got plenty of room. Uh, right now I've got my, my large medium format film camera in here, and there's lots of space for all this stuff. You know, this, this takes up more space than any DSLR out there right now. Um, you could easily put a full frame body with a 70 to, 70 to 200 millimeter lens and another lens and a speed light, maybe four lenses total. There's lots of space in this thing for your stuff. And then there's also organizing pockets that are see-through. That's nice, the little memory card pockets. I don't, I don't personally find these super useful um, because I, I put my cards in a wallet, but you know, they're there. Maybe stick a stick of gum in there. I don't know. When your, bag, when your card is used, maybe stick it in there so that it's, uh, you know that it's not to be written over anymore. Um, more pockets on the outside, you know, a generous pocket there, a split pocket on the outside right here for all your little sundry things, your business cards, your pens and everything. And then um, I also like on the bottom, it's got, it's got these little rubber feet to keep it up off the ground, just so, you know, just to, to keep it from scuffing a lot. But even so, it's got a high denier, Cordura-like fabric on the bottom. It's got a comfortable waistband, a, a comfortable waist belt. When you're walking around with heavy stuff on your back, using the waist belt really helps relieve the pressure on your shoulders. Um, and the shoulder straps are nice and padded. You know, it's it's got, th this I, I like quite a lot. This little strap is to go over the vertical handle on your luggage so that um, you can you can wheel them both around together and this bag is small enough to fit under the seat on just about any airplane so you could carry it as your second piece of carry-on luggage as well as your roller board if you travel that's a nice thing you know it's got uh it's got the the sternum strap and it's got a whistle on it if you blow hard it'll work um it's it's a good bag you know it's got the the little pocket over here where you can stick a tripod in there perhaps a small tripod, a tall tripod would be sticking out quite a ways, but um, it's got bar tacks on all the stress points, so it's it's well made and quite strong. And I think you'd I think you'd really like it. It comes with a um, a rain cover as well that deploys from inside there. And that you know, sometimes you're out and you just get caught, and so that's handy to have. For this price and for these features, this is a terrific bag. It's not you know, a fancy bag, but it's an extremely well-made, simple backpack, and I'd recommend it. So that's the Ruggerd Thunderhead 35. Thanks for joining me.